<clears throat> hey everybody, Sister Fantastic here, and today's video is with the Collabtastic Ladies, and we are using this Hip Dot Cenote Palette. Oh my gosh, y'all. I've had this for a couple of months. I've been waiting to, for the right opportunity to use it, and so we are all ready. Joy Grendel and Becky's Empty Nest and I are going to be using this palette today. And so all those blues and greens automatically just jump out and scream, Hi, hello, please use me. But I think for today's look, y'all, this green right here, that olive green is just calling my name. So I definitely want to use that olive green. I'm probably going to lean more towards the neutral end of the palette and maybe put a pop of color down on the bottom lash line. We'll see how that goes. My base is already done, done my eyebrows, put on some bronzer, foundation, powder, concealer, all those things, and just a little bit of lip gloss, and that's where I'm at today. So I'm gonna just jump right in to this palette, and I want to begin by using a fluffy brush and just sweeping a just a bit of color. I'm going to start with this one right here called Bedrock. Just a little wash of color. And just get something on my lids. And then we'll see where this goes. So I'll just tap it on first and then and blend it out. My um, concealer is set on my eyelids, so this shade right here is going on pretty smooth. But just having this transition color down underneath the others is going to really help everything blend. So I want to make sure and do a good job with this shade right here. And I got a lot of real estate here on my eyelids to cover because I have hooded eyes, so I want to make sure and, and get this on really good. I love this palette, y'all. It is so pretty. And I have never used the shadows from this brand before, but there's just a lot of uh, positive reviews about it, uh, especially from those um, in the BoxyCharm community because they're the ones that are have received it lately and anyway since this palette came out this was I think they came out with another palette first a warmer like purples and uh, plums and peaches and I never did get that palette but I recently picked it up in a add-on sale so now I have both of the hip dot palettes but this is the first one that I'm using but both palettes have gotten pretty decent reviews and I've not really seen too much anything negative about these palettes. Anyway, they are they are still available, I believe, on the BoxyCharm. You have to be subscribed to BoxyCharm to participate in their uh, add-on sales and their pop-up sales. But if you are a subscriber, even with the base box, you can get in there and buy a lot of these things at a really huge discounted price some of it's even up to 80% off all right so there's a little sh uh, wash of color all right now I'm just gonna go in with a I want to go in with this this brown shade here it's called subsurface so I'm just gonna take a another uh, shader brush it's a little bit more dense and I just want to like focus that right here in the outer V and create a shape I'm gonna start right here at the lower lash line and then just kind of blend up 
creating that that V shape and just kind of extending that out a bit so I'm going to relax my eye and that way I can get the shape that I want look straight ahead so you can see how that's going out all right I'm gonna do the other eye And again, relaxing my arm and just blending that out to where I get that nice shape that I'm wanting. Okay. And then I'm just going to look ahead to see that it's even and do a bit more blending where I see that it needs it. Okay. Now with my finger, I want to go in with this, this olive green shade. It's called Cave. Right there. And I'm just going to Put that right here on the lid and right above the lid. I'm just going to kind of blend that on up into what I've already done. Wow, that is so pretty. This shade is awesome. It's like a bronzy, olive greenish gold. Let me get close where y'all can see it. So I'm just like gonna round this out. And that way when I open my eye, you can still see it peeking out from above the crease just a little bit however when I'm applying it and I go that far up it looks like I'm going way up but that just shows you how hooded my my lids are oh my gosh y'all this shade is is life I knew when I opened up this palette and I really looked at it hard, this is the direction I wanted to go. Alright, now I'm going to take that that brush that I used to apply that brown shade, that dark, it's called a subsurface, and I'm just going to kind of go around the edge here and just blend a little bit. make sure all that's blended in really good 
Okay, and I'm gonna take that first brush that I used with the bedrock shade, just whatever's left on the brush, and I'm just gonna go right up and blend around that. And just soften those edges. Okay, now I need an inner corner. So I'm thinking about using this gold shade here called Escape. So let's try that. Oh yeah. That is pretty, y'all. That is really super pretty. Okay, so we're just kind of mimicking some, like, it looks like a fall colored look, but, you know, spring is about to burst forth, and this is really what the earth looks like right now. There's not a whole lot of color in the earth right now. It's some dead leaves and, you know, some green grass underneath there. All right, now, I'm going to... Let me just swatch those two for you and see what I'm working with. There's the gold and there's that olive green. That's just what was left on my fingers. So y'all could see that. All right, now I want to find a pop of color for this lower lash line. Let me find a decent brush here. Just a small one. Let me use this one right here. And I'm going to go in with mm, Decisions, Decisions. Yeah, I'm going to go in with this color called Goddess, right there in the middle. That bright emerald green. And I'm going to use that underneath the lash line. And we'll see how this works out. Boom, shakalaka. That's definitely a pop of color. Love, love, love this color green. take it up above right there in the corner and just kind of connect all that like an eyeliner kind of a look like an inverted inverted eyeliner look Really close, really close to the lash line. Starting about halfway over, going out to the edge and just letting that corner connect and just bring it up. 
for an eyeliner look. Y'all, this is fun. Don't want to disappoint by using just all neutrals and not putting some kind of fun color in this look. All these pretty colors in this palette. This emerald green here reminds me of Destin, Florida, y'all. The Emerald Coast. The water there is so crystal clear. And it's th from up in the sky. This is what the color of the, the ocean, the Gulf of Mexico, looks like. It's beautiful there. The sand is white. If you've never been, you need to go. The fishing's great. The beaches are awesome. The restaurants have the best food. If you love seafood, it's a great place to go on vacation and eat. Take the whole family. All right, let's do a lip look here. I'm going to use this uh, pencil here. It's uh, by Jessica Liebenskind, the Vintage Cosmetics, and it's in the color Mocha. It's like a mauve. And then I'm going to put a, like a little touch of peach on top of it. It's as um, the Butanic Beauty um, Lip and Cheek Balm in the color Peach Blush. And I had this, I had it, one of these in my giveaway, one of my giveaways recently. So I wanted y'all to see what it looks like. Just adds a real nice rosiness to go with those greens. Okay. All right, now y'all, I'm gonna put on some mascara and some lashes, and I will be right back. All right, y'all, I'm back with uh, lashes and mascara on, and now I'm gonna do some highlighter. And I'm going to go into my Anastasia uh, Nicole Guerrero highlighter kit. And I'm going to use Forever Young and Kitty Cat. I'm going to mix these two right here. And I'm going to use my Alomar um, highlighting brush. And add some highlighter to this look. That is, that is the finished look, you guys. You have to let me know what you think. This is such a pretty palette. I mean, if you are a neutral lover like me, and you just, you know, feel more comfortable using the neutrals, there's plenty to work with here. There's uh, that shade that we started out with. There's this warm brown. There's that uh, uh, the darker chocolate brown. There's a really pretty like a navy right there and then there's a teal blue and then you've got these uh, these golds and that green right there that I use that olive green and then you know if you wanted to go with blues you know you've got the whole you know set of blues here that icy blue right there it's just a really really pretty palette uh, you know you could do all neutrals 
Uh, or you could do neutrals with a pop of color or you could go with blues or you could focus in on the greens you know like this one and that one and that one this this whole quad right here would be really pretty anyway just it's going to be a lot of fun to play with i can't wait to play with this some more so next time i'll have to come back and do a, a, a look with the blues it's hard to get away from the green though i'll tell you these greens right here mm, awesome awesome chef's kiss mwah, on the greens anyway i think i got this lash on kind of cock out of y'all it's bugging me anyway let me know down in the comments what you think if you have the hip dot palette and what do you think about it and do you have the other hip dot palette and let me know down in the comments and uh, anyway if you want to collab with me just let me know just hit me up on the messenger send me a dm for a makeup look or whatever if you want to be um hooking up with us and the collabtastic ladies you know it'd be fun to you know have somebody new to join us if you want to do a collab giveaway let me know that too i'm all about the collabs i love collabs i think it's so much fun to work with people and to create things together so i can't wait to see what joy and becky does and their looks this time make sure and visit their channels i'll link them down below and thank you so much for taking time out of your busy day to spend with me and i appreciate you so much god bless you today is my prayer and i'll see it in the next video bye